This tutorial will guide on how to use the expert mode. Launch the scan app and click the right expert icon. Expert mode has been executed. The icon in the upper right corner is the scan icon. The scan window launches and icons that were previously not exposed are now activated. The top bar is used to adjust the projector brightness. Brightness can be adjusted manually by the drag of the mouse, or by using the icon on the right. Automatic brightness is recommended. The scanner arm can also be manipulated. The scanner arm can be manually moved by the drag of the mouse, or simply by entering the desired angle. The rotation plate can also be manually rotated. The rotation can be done by the drag of the mouse, or simply be entering the desired angle. In expert mode, the desired scan strategy can be selected. Touch the arrow icon to view the default scan strategies. The scan options button opens a setup window allowing for adjustment of the scanner details. Be cautious when modifying setting options. The following option allows for a texture scan. Activate the option to perform a texture scan. Press the scan button to begin scanning. The preview button maneuvers the model to the position displayed on the screen. The home button moves the model to the home position. The scan button with number 1 to take only one shot from that angle. Drag the mouse to perform additional scans. Edit button allows for removal of excess data. When the scanning is complete, click the OK button. An item named Scan1 is created in the data list. Next, the prepped die is separately scanned. Re-enter the scan window. Place the prepped die in the scanner and begin scan. When the scan is complete, Scan2 is created in the data list. Show, Hide button is used to select scan data from the screen. Now let's match the two scan data. Clicking the matching button opens the matching options window. Activate, Fixed, for base data and activate, Floating, for moving data. The Auto Detect button is used for automatic matching. For this example, the three-point match feature is used. Moving data is shown on the left and base data on the right. Identify three points on common surfaces. Data shown on the left is automatically moved to the right. When the alignment is complete, click the OK button. Global match allows for a more dense data. Selecting the build button displays the build options. The value for the build options can also be adjusted. Press the build button below to start the build. STL file is generated after the build process. For this example, the build process is complete with the base model and prep die separated. First, remove any overlapping data between the base model and the prep die. Click the Tools button, and click Remove Common Points button. Set the base model for source and the prep die for subtract. Click the remove button to automatically delete the prepped die part from the base model. The base model data is without the prepped die data. 
select only the prepped die from the show hide button and start the build. Next, select only the base model and start the build. STL files for the base model and the prep die have been generated separately. The generated STL files can be saved in any location by pressing the export button. Thank you.